I'm just uh, finishing the last 200 meters or so of uh, running 26.6 miles. 26.6 miles. I've just run that and I uh, didn't stop throughout the running. I've run all the way and uh, my underneath my feet are in the most worst pain that I've ever had. I've never trained for running over the London, higher um, mileage than the London Marathon. Uh, so this is the first time I've ever done it. So I thought the best way would be to just jump in and just run 26.2 miles, but I've done 26.6 miles. So this is the hardest thing I've ever done. My legs are in agony. My feet are in the worst pain I've ever felt. So, uh, but I'm glad I've achieved it. So I'm just running to the last, uh, last bit and I, I haven't stopped running throughout the whole thing. I ran all the way and my, the technique that I used was just saying that no matter what happens, I am going to make sure that I finish. And that's what I did. And all through running, I said to myself, I just kept repeating it to myself. I'm not going to give up. I'm not going to stop. And I managed, my legs are like jelly. They keep going from under me, but I'm not, I just made up my mind. I'm not going to stop. And I think that's the key with uh, marathon running. It's my first marathon I've ever run. The most I'd ever run before this was 1.7 miles. And I thought to myself, if I'm going to do it, just jump in and do it. And uh, with no preparation, nothing, I just went for it. And uh, I've done it because I said, no matter what happens, even if I die doing it, I'm not going to stop. And I'm just coming up to the last 50 meters or so, last 50 meters, and then I've uh, completed it. And uh, it's made me so happy because I had arthritis in my knees. I couldn't move my legs for a lot of my childhood. I had asthma. I couldn't run cross country. So running was something I thought I'd never be able to do. And now I'm doing it. And I've run a marathon, no one helping me, just me on my own. I've run the full distance. I'm just coming up to the last 30 meters. And now I'm gonna make it my goal if possible, if I can, to run a marathon every week or every two weeks. Just take a day off from other training and just uh, run that distance because I saw really low, it's very, very painful. But uh, I've thoroughly enjoyed it. And only it's the first time, so maybe after that, it will just get easier. So I'm sure the only way, once I've felt the worst pain, the pain will just get less. Unless, so now I'm just coming up to the finishing part now. Last 10 meters, and then I've done it 26.6 miles running all the way non stop. You can see the field's bobbing up and down because I am absolutely saluted and I did it. So I hope this inspires you to, to even if you can't run a full marathon, just to do the best you can and run as full as you can.